With E3 2021 virtually right around the corner, being only three weeks away, there are of course rumors, leaks, and unofficial announcements gliding through the internet that are making their way to our timelines and feeds everywhere. One of the biggest and most recently discussed rumors is a new Donkey Kong Country game, coming to Switch this year in 2021 and getting a reveal at E3 in June. In today's video, we're going to discuss these rumors and take a deep dive into the leaks and see how realistically plausible this is. As always, make sure you subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our weekly uploads. And without further ado, let's jump into today's topic. The last Donkey Kong game to release was Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze on February 14th, 2014 for Wii U. However, this game was also re-released on Nintendo Switch on May 4th in 2018, so there hasn't been a brand new Donkey Kong game since 2014 and of course this is the 40th anniversary of the original Donkey Kong arcade game. With that in mind, it doesn't solidify the possibility that we see a release of a new DK game this year since Nintendo doesn't always celebrate anniversaries that we anticipate. However, it does further strengthen the argument that if we were going to get a new Donkey Kong to a game to release, this year would be one of the better years to do it. So far we know it's been over 3 years since the last Donkey Kong Country game, and after 7 years since the last new Donkey Kong Country game was released, so why else is it possible that we would see a reveal trailer and release date in this next installment of this franchise during our E3 of this year? Well, this leak was actually sparked by an update to the Diddy Kong Sprite on the Nintendo Japan website. The most recent picture that Nintendo had for Diddy Kong Sprite on that website was from 2007. That was the last time they updated a sprite, so why would they do an update to it now unless there's something incoming where Diddy Kong would be a big player? We know of course that Donkey Kong will always be the main focus of the Donkey Kong Country franchise, but what if Nintendo is actually putting together a new Donkey Kong Country game that also focuses heavily on Diddy? Maybe you will be able to have two players where one is Donkey Kong and one is Diddy Kong, or maybe the game will be split into two parts where you can play as each of them individually as the story connects. There are a lot of possibilities here, with the second half of 2021 being widely opened by Nintendo's current slate of games, it would be no surprise if they decide to celebrate DK's 40th anniversary with the release of a brand new Donkey Kong Country game for the Switch or even possibly the Switch Pro. There is another big leak and rumor that has surfaced recently, which makes the possibility of a new Donkey Kong Country game releasing this year look even more legitimate. Apparently, the newest and yet to be seen installment of the Donkey Kong franchise has been in development since late 2017 and early 2018. What's key about this development start date is that it's nearly confirmed that Nintendo had moved to bring Donkey Kong game development back to in-house development, meaning that Nintendo itself, including the studios it owns, would be responsible for the creation and development of Donkey Kong video games moving forward. To take it a step further, it's actually being reported that the newest installment of the franchise is being developed by the same team that created and developed Super Mario Odyssey for its release date in October of 2017. So a new Donkey Kong game goes into development late in 2017, and Super Mario Odyssey was released in late 2017. See what we're getting at? It would make perfect sense for this development team to be the first team to work on this franchise now that it's back home in-house at Nintendo. And for the foreseeable future, all Donkey Kong video games will be released from in-house teams and developers. Unfortunately, if this does ring true, and the Super Mario Odyssey team has been developing the newest installment in the Donkey Kong franchise, that means they probably haven't been working on a sequel to Super Mario Odyssey, and that we could possibly not see another 3D Mario game release for quite some time. Or, they could do what classic development teams and studios do, and have part of the team now applying the finishing touches to the new Donkey Kong game, while the majority of the team is working on the next big Mario game. Either way, it's exciting to hear this kind of rumor. One that completely makes sense, lines up perfectly with time frames, and one that isn't too far-fetched to begin with. It's completely in the realm of possibility that the same team that developed Super Mario Odyssey is developing the latest Donkey Kong game, and how amazing will that game be if this turns out to be legitimate? 
One side note that has also been thrown around a lot in regards to the new Donkey Kong game rumors is if the game will be 3D. Well, if the team behind it is the Super Mario Odyssey team, then you can bet they'd most likely be making it a 3D game and what better way to celebrate Donkey Kong's 40th anniversary with not only a new Donkey Kong game, but a 3D Donkey Kong game in the style of Super Mario Odyssey and developed by the same team. Thank you all for watching today's video. This rumor has been flying about crazily for a few weeks now, so we just had to cover it, especially with E3 being very close by. Let's all hope we get to see a trailer for a new Donkey Kong video game during E3, and let us know in the comments below what your thoughts are on everything we covered about this today. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and share with friends if you feel they'd be interested. Thanks again everyone for watching this video, and we'll see you all in the next one.